laps to go. It'll be the white flag this time by. All, all deals off here with two laps to go. Oh, we got a trouble off turn two. Colin Brown in the 16 car noses into the wall and the concrete slides down the back straightaway. The 20 car goes to victory lane once again. Denny Hamlin takes the win as the car spins out of turn four into the grass area. That is Mike Wallace and his Toyota, our in-race reporter, and he has had some significant contact coming out of turn four. There is the contact. It is Mike Wallace and his nephew, Stephen Wallace, as they come together. Took a very hard lick against the inside wall and the front of his Toyota damage, and Mike pretty hot when he climbed out of the car and was headed back up pit road, was intercepted by a NASCAR official. Mike, we saw the replay. You watched it. What happened from the driver's seat? Well, it appears the black and white car behind me just run into me off a of turn four. You know, I was up on the outside, had fresh tires. Uh, there was about five of us that come and get tires. And, uh, you know, the, the nice part about having an in-car camera in a car pretty well tells a story. There's no use me wasting my time and explain it. Everybody's seen it at home. And it's real frustrating. Last lap coming into checkered, clearly going to, you know, have a end up with a decent finish. Going to run 11th or 12th, it looked like, right behind the 60 car there. And, uh, you know, to get crashed in the straightaway is just not really good. But uh, I was told uh, the front end was pushed on his car. I'd, you know, lift if it's pushing. Drive your car, you know. Well, you noted it was Stephen Wallace, your nephew. How is that different when it's family? How do you deal with a situation like that from here on out? Jamie, it's probably just best I don't say anything. I've done express myself to Stephen back in the back, and we'll leave it like that. And, uh, you know, this, this is probably not the best place to air our differences right now. He knows what, he, what, what happened. Did attempt to talk to Steven. He has left the building.